Welcome to my channel where you can bolster up your IT skills and today we're going to talk about a really cool feature in Microsoft Excel. Actually we're going to talk about two functions and we're going to use them to have a really neat result. What we're going to do today, before we begin make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so you do not miss out on upcoming tutorials. So today we're going to talk about splitting the text in Excel but we're going to use it in a very specific scenario. So we have the data and we have the first and last name in one column, which is column A. I have two placeholders waiting for the first name and last name to be stored here. I need a function to extract first name and last name in specific cells. There are a lot of ways to achieve that. And you might, for example, use text to columns or some old school functions like left, right, find. You could put a lot of strenuous exertion to achieve that, but Excel is thriving and it's 2024, almost 2025. So let's use these brand new functions in Excel 365. So how are we going to achieve that? What I want to do here is I want to extract the text that is before a very specific character, which is a space here. So I want to extract everything that is before the space. So even with natural language, I might type that I want to have the text here, which is text before so the function is called text before and it basically does what the name implies it takes the text and extract the text before a given character right here is going to be the space so what is my text excel asks me and i'm telling the excel well look excel this is the text from which I want to take the text before and I need to specify this very specific delimiter, which is a space here. So quotation mark, space, quotation mark. Why do I embrace it in quotation marks? Because it is a text, so I need to put a text in quotation marks here. And when I hit enter, I see perfectly extracted text before the space. Developing from here, I can go to last name column and say that in that column, I would like to have the text that goes after the space. So once again, Excel asks me, and where is that text? I'm telling it, oh, you know, it's in A to cell. I see that at name because it is a real Excel table. And the separator here, the delimiter is once again the space and I close the parentheses. Boom, and it worked. I have these two perfect formulas that can work for me even when I add data later on. So look, if for some reason I'm going to add my name here, it's going to be automatically split. I don't have to reapply any tools like, for example, text to columns, but I'm going to add a name and Excel is going to actually a table, a real Excel table is going to imbibe this text that I'm putting it and then it's going to split it into cells. So my name, which is not an easy one for you, but anyway, it's Kamil Targosinski. So I put Kamil Targosinski here and you see it's perfectly split immediately. So if you do not want to miss out on these kind of tricks in Microsoft Excel and other tools, make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification and see you soon.